The ref row's expression is in the category list and has a result of a list data type. The purpose of this expression is to gather related rows from a table that reference the row you're currently in. The ref row's expression contains two parameters. The first is the name of the table or slice where the data will be found. The second is the name of the column in the data set that contains a ref data type. This needs to be a reference to the table you're currently in. The result is a list of rows whose reference columns match this row. Let's look at an example. Here we can see the ref rows expression. This tells us that we're looking in the work order line item table, and we specifically want to look at the work order ID column in that table. It's going to pull all of those that match the row we're currently in. I'm going to pull up a test, and while I do, let's check out these tables. We're currently in the work order table, and this is actually a column that AppSheet created for me. Most ref rows expressions are from columns that AppSheet creates for you when you create a reference. When we go to the work order line item table, we see a work order ID column, and its column type is reference. Here we can see that it's referencing the work order table, which is what we said we were in initially. When we look at the test, we can see a list of key values, which are the rows that match the key for this column. These are the keys for the table that they come from. I hope this was helpful. If you would like to learn more, we invite you to check out appsheetraining.com.